95.5 R&B and old school for the Lou. I don't uh, want that. Uh, hold on, we on, we it's, on, a, it's the people uh, takeover. We ain't playing nobody else's music. <laughs> all right, we are not playing nobody else's music if it ain't Peebo. That's how we doing this, all right? All right, G Wiz is here as well. Time to What's going on? What's you going got on? it, man. Peebo Bryson. So I'm going to put Wiz on the spot. Wiz, I know it's something that you want to ask Peebo Come since on, you're here. Bring it on, Wiz. Okay. What is your favorite? personal favorite Peebo song? Yeah, man, that's a really tough question. I, you know, I, I'll never forget the feeling that I had when I, the first time I heard Feel the Fire. Uh, the, the first time I wrote the hook and and, and heard myself sing it, I, I, I got a chill. Uh, but that, and, and actually, I'm saying to you, nobody liked but myself, my, my sister and my manager. <laughs> nobody else liked it. What? I did it anyway. Really? What? Uh, yeah, in, in the first number one. <laughs> <laughs> so what? how do you feel right now? <laughs> well, you know, right. I mean, I ask a lot of people about it, you know. Uh, but I, 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 we finished it, and I asked a lot of people. I was like, wait a minute. So what would you do? Uh, what? How do you feel about it? So well, I would just start all over again. I would scrap the whole project, start all over again, hire LA musicians, and uh, just do it again. I said, really? You? That's the way you feel about it? Yeah, I said, well, I'm going to play this hand. You know, I, nice. I, I believe in it. You know, you can't, no one should ever allow anybody to decide what their portion is or which direction they should go and all that. Be your own person and all that. You know, that's, it, it's easy to say that, but it's, it's, it's also easy to get discouraged by somebody's negative comments about something that you do mm -hmm. or you don't do. But uh, Christopher Cross was told not to quit his day job. Mm -hmm. uh, Elton John was told that he was over and the Bee Gees were all told to not quit their day jobs mm -hmm. so but that year that that Christopher Cross could not get signed and Elton John was told that he was over someone took a chance on Christopher Christopher Cross and the the, the year that that that's that project was released he and Elton John were responsible for forty percent of all pop record sales. That's crazy. Mm. Mm. Somebody you can't listen to anybody no. tell you about what your portion is, who you are, no. uh -huh. or, or are someone standing over you counting to ten. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You can stand over me counting to ten all you want to. You're gonna get <laughs> you're gonna get disappointed. I'll tell you when. You know, because it, it, here's the thing. You know, I mean, it's my blessing, isn't it? Yeah, yes. it is. You know, yes. so you don't you didn't give it to me, so you don't get a chance to take it away or mm -hmm. disavow it. Right. A, there's a difference between uh, a, a very talented vocalist, uh, a, a great vocalist, and an anointed vo vocalist. Right. Mm -hmm. These are these are all different things. Mm -hmm. And uh, uh, anointed music is different from great music. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, it's uh, anointed music is. Great music is what it is. It's great. Mm -hmm. a, a great artist is what he is or, or she is. They're great. But anointed means something totally different. Uh, when Aretha Franklin sang, take me to heart and I'll always love you, yeah. it made you and you, me and, 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 yeah. and everybody, every other man want to be a better man. Right. right. Because it spoke to our souls, <laughs> even though it wasn't, wasn't written to us, right. for us. It was mm -hmm. to, to remind women that they were not alone. <laughs> right, but it made us want to be better men. So, well, so when you, when you look at it from that standpoint, it's hard to, it's hard for me to actually choose one song over and over another one. Um, it, but there are songs that I like probably more than others, I mean, and I, I would say that when when the apartheid was going on in South Africa it was still going on. And when they were trying to change and make a transition of power and all that kind of stuff, I wrote a song called "I Wish You Love," and it's a it's about love being the greatest thing that you can wish for anybody. You need the greatest gift you can give to anybody. I mean, my 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 philosophy on on standing for love, or stand for love, my new album is the theme hasn't changed because it it, it doesn't have to because as as a as subject matter, 
Uh, if you, if I write about love every single day for the rest of my life, I could and I would never re have to repeat myself. You know what I mean? Because every relationship and every moment of every relationship is a, a, a separate entity within itself. All right, Peebo Bryson live in the studio. Sure, it is. Fabulous Fox Theater. Yes, the Fabulous Fox. We're going to be there. And with my girl, who's an anointed voice. We yes. talk about Gladys Knight. We talk about anointed. When Gladys sings about hurt, we all feel yeah. it. <laughs> well, we hurt that she won't come to the studio. How about that? Well, <laughs> you know, but here's the thing. She, Wait a minute, is that, that was who you was with last time, yeah, right? That's who yeah, yeah, again, yeah, that's, that's exactly. Chesterfield. That's Epic right. Day. Exactly. She was a headliner. That's correct. Yeah. I didn't even think about that. And I still didn't meet her yeah. that night. I DJed right. the concert. We yeah. was there. You she's was cool. Lovely. You you was there at South Oh, check. she's lovely. I'm yeah. not saying she's not cool, but what a coincidence. Both times you've been here, I met you. <laughs> All of the song I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> Deja vu, vu. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Is it raining? Hey, we we'll see if it's raining outside. Well, yeah. you, know, you, you know what? You know what I've learned of late uh, is that uh, there's a reason for the things people do that's beyond what we know. And okay, to not to, it's like I learned this from actually Beauty and the Beast. You gotta look beyond the surface to find the the, the true beauty. Okay. You know. What I mean? so, well, I'm, you know, you got. I'm and, at and, I'll, and I'll and I'll and no, I know. I know. Hey, he involved in tension right there. But, you know, we I, are radio fans, I know. and we want to meet her. I know. Right? I, I know. All that I mean, sound nice. I, I know. I know. <laughs> but I, I'll I'll actually tell you why later. Okay. Okay. Yeah. You know, I'll I'll, right. I'll share something with you. All right. Later. Yeah. Hey, love like yours and mine. You know another song that I secretly sang background on. Uh, right? you, we Bryson. know you did it, right? <laughs> <laughs> we know you did. All right, get y'all tickets, man. People, Bryson.